Hi everyone, hope you're doing well from whatever you're watching this channel, depending on your time zone. Right now, Rigatha Gashagwa, his wife and his children are at the current hospital. Um, the family is just uh, looking after their father as he go through the treatment. And uh, for the first time, the doctor who is attending to Rigatha Gashagwa has come out to speak, Dr. Dan Gikonyo. He is actually um, sharing out about Gashagwa's situation and which way forward. According to him, Gashagwa, when they are complaining about the chest pain, and uh, he has really elaborated uh, what uh, chest pain can lead into. And then uh, what causes this? That Gashagwa is in serious stress. And out of this stress, it can cause a heart problem. So because of that, they are not just going to release the Gather Gashagwa to get out. They are going to keep him in hospital for about 48 to 72 hours minimum. So for them, in fact, they believe that they have to stay with him up to 72 hours before they discharge him from the hospital. Now, this means that at least Gashagwa is going to stay quite good time in the hospital. Dr. from where you sit, um, will he spend the night here? Um, is he likely to spend the night or more, more days in this facility? If you, if you come with chest pain in any hospital in this country or in the world, you you will be held captive for at least 24, 72 hours to rule out serious issues. I'm sure you guys read a lot. Stress can cause heart problems, we know that. And, and the, the, the DP is definitely a lot of stress. I'm sure you've heard about something called Takosubo syndrome, the broken heart syndrome, all those things that can cause severe heart problems. So all those are possibilities. So I would say if you come in that type of uh, situation, you need to be observed for about 24, for, I mean 48 to 72 hours. Yeah. Uh, Dr. Recovery may, may vary from patient to patient, yeah. but perhaps uh, you've had experience and you've handled such cases before. Um, do you foresee him being admitted for a while or how are you treating this? At, at least maybe 48 to 72 hours minimum, yeah. Mm. So, you know, for us, we always play on the safe side. You don't want to rush and make a mistake. You want to make sure that when you are done, you have done and you are sure that somebody is safe. Mm. Yeah. Now, as we continue with the final discussion, just a quick request for those who are watching and you have not yet subscribed, please consider subscribing to our returning subscribers. Master, thank you so much. And again, to all our viewers, please give this video a thumbs up. Thank you so much. And back to this discussion. Now, it is in public knowledge that the deputy president is in serious uh, stress, a lot of stress, because he can't believe that he's the one who is being kicked out of the office in the middle of their first term. He has been kicked out. So he saw it coming. And being a human being, udasikia dami kienda kwa mwili mbio. So, mene issues will be raised about the shagwa being in hospital, including faking the sickness. Yo renga alisema, pale ya kwamba ambule za hikuja kuchukua the shagwa, he just walked to the hospital by himself. Of course, he's right. There was no ambule that came for him. But he just disappeared. Even his lawyer seems to have been not aware of where the Shagwa is. So the doctor is clear. Stress can lead to heart attack. So if the Shagwa has to say to stay 72 hours in hospital. 
It means you will be in hospital on Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Therefore, you can be discharged on Monday or Sunday evening. And the doctor is insisting they will not allow him just to live like that. They are extra careful on this. So, it will be through the doctor's advice. Now, we are talking about the National Assembly. Not the National Assembly, actually. The Senate that was supposed to work within a time frame. For them, they had up to Saturday. But you listening to the sentiment from the doctor. He's talking about 72 hours, that three days. So that means latest, uh, uh, earliest, the can be released or discharged in, uh, from the hospital is on Sunday, latest Monday. That is past the time frame of his impeachment within the law. But this team, if you go by their position, is that the Senate can only operate outside the law in the case they want to continue with the impeachment of one regarding the Shagwa. But then, how do you justify that one? It will be a tool that will be used in the court of law against the National Assembly Speaker and the Senate Speaker and the entire team. Saying that what will what they will have done would be nullified, null and void. So that's also one hard thing. But again, there has been questions about the hospitals in this country. Should Gashagwa trust the hospitals here? That's a question I've been reading throughout. I don't understand my but Santa Quanta Hospital is not safe for him. That hospitals in this country are not safe for Gashagwa. Ajaribu Kwangini. So, in as much as here, he is in war. And uh, I saw some people predicting that, which is also my view, that Shagwa might be flown out of this country to seek medical attention elsewhere. Just get lab there, Amanda, South Africa, come and see your evil, I go US, come at Ibab, I'm Amanda, India. So he might fly out of the country. for treatment, buy time, then come back. That can be the situation, but the doctor has already informed you that this man need a lot of rest to calm down and collect himself. That is the situation. So, we'll be waiting more from the doctor to understand and by tomorrow, we will know if Gashaga will continue to receive treatment from this hospital or if he is going to fly out of the country and seek medical attention elsewhere. Again, how about the Since I'm doing Gashaga, I'm going to stress. The doctor has confirmed that he is stressed. And the stress can cause a huge damage. So, with this situation, uh, the sympathy for Gashaga will continue. As people continue to share his situation outside, with the moment the sympathy Continues. To look at my own at the shack, I look up and pack a zilla bit and come and learn a staff working. The quanta could to me a quail sitting. I will come and talk and a bit to pack and buy. They are well sealed, required a cali. Fortunately, Hayukoko Akoko Hospital. 
So this can be a tactic or again very truthful as far as what the doctor has said. It is either way. Now I want to just at least a minute to kill a kid, but the query ni kwamba stress in a kwa mingi because Gashaka did not see it coming that Ruto can organize his removal from office. But it has happened. He came to learn that the Senate is going to impeach him. So he had to rush away and buy time. Or if not, it just came to his mind that it is happening. And of course it can be stressful. Imagine if you put your money in a campaign. Two billion or three. Or even one billion. It's not easy. But then you have a campaign of president. And you have a lot of money. You have a lot of money. You have a lot of It needs a real serious budget. And we've had how Roto had a problem with the money during the 2022 campaign. The man who came to the rescue was the man that he has organized his firing through the impeachment. Has Gashaka recovered his money? The answer can be no. You know, she did again as us. What are to me a woman buy? So that can lead to this stress because he will not have any other chance to use it so that he can achieve his money because he's not in power. Ayoko Wongos, Ayoko, Ayoko. So how can he regain his money? Very hard question.